Hi guys. Okay, I have to dip out. So I wanted to go live really quick because I wanted to make an herbal blend for a friend, but she kind of had an emergency and left already. So I had to quickly make her the blend. Um, so yeah, esperate. Give me a second, let me send a text that I am live. I'm live putting together an herbal blend, comma, come join me, exclamation mark. Okay, so uh, let me just go over the herbs. I made two anti-inflammatory herbal blends today. So if you do not have a notebook and a pen for my lives, I highly recommend buying one. You can get a notebook for less than a dollar and you can get pens real easily, okay? I dyed my hair that color of your wig. Ooh! Hi, Ashbuck. How are you doing, girl? Hi, Leo. Ooh, you got here before. Sent a text. Hey, girl. Hi. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Patricia. Hi, Jamie. Thank you. My eyes so much better. Like last night, Christy, when I took out this contact, oh, it was like I could barely open my eye. See, my, my eye is fine. It was just, when I, I have a very bad habit of sleeping with my contacts in and it's really not okay. And last night, I made sure I took out my other contact, but I'm gonna keep, I don't have a contact case. So what I did was I have like these little plates, these little, these little plates, I just tilted it right here, put some contact solution and put my contacts in there. But I needed to go to the store and get a contact case and be, I mean, seriously, I was telling that to Vaughn and telling him how this is just, I really only have two eyes. That's not okay for me to be in such a bad habit because, you know, it's all fun and games until something really serious happens. And yesterday was just a reminder how it's not okay. It was, it's very easy for my eye to heal again. So I, I took it out. It was irritated. The light was just irritating, but it's good. It, it doesn't even... My eyes don't look red. Do you see? <laughs> uh, uh, but anyways, I have both my contacts in and I am going to take them out more readily. Thank you, Kami. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Danielle. Thank you, Megan. This wig is so bomb. I have this in now, this color, um, in four different wigs. And then these are some super old earrings that I used to sell. I do not have any more, but I love, I love my heart jewelry. Heart jewelry is the bomb. I also have this ring. I have on my nails, look at the little rhinestones that have the little chains. And then here I sell um, these two. None of these are available, but look at how pretty. Like, I just love my jewelry. You know, I be feeling extra cute. Um, I have an EXO gold necklace, so I need to wear that before I leave. Anyways, so there were two different people today that I made anti-inflammatory herbal blends for. And if you do not have a notebook, I recommend, like, writing this down somewhere, using notes or whatever. It's just good information uh, because a lot of times, even if you don't think you need it right now, you know, even if you, you don't think you, you need the, the knowledge right now, at some point you are. Um, somebody else you're going to know is going to need this help. I'm pretty sure right now you know someone that has severe inflammation. Raise your hand if you are someone who has severe inflammation. Raise your hand if your muscles need help. Raise your hand if your muscles be just they need gain, they need strength, they need to be repaired. Raise your hand if your nervous system is out of whack. Raise your hand if you have fibromyalgia. Let me put my hand down because I don't have it no more. I used to have fibromyalgia. I used to have rheumatoid arthritis. I, I was diagnosed with autoimmune diseases. I don't have any of them anymore. It's amazing. So let me show you. So today, uh, let me take you to my, my room. Hold up. 
not my room, but Vaughn's room. But anyways, I'm so excited. <laughs> so I had this one already, but this one just, just got put up today, okay? We, listen, I am not messing around. When I tell you I'm gonna be taking care of my baby, I am not playing. Look, okay, I'm so excited. So these drawers need, you know, more stuff in it. We just got this put up today. I got it delivered a bit ago, but, but look at how deep the drawers are. Dude, look at that. I mean, I could fit so much stuff in here. Like I am going to be, I am not messing around. Okay. Let me take care of my mans. I got it all covered from here. Okay. Yes, Bridget. <laughs> That's awesome. So I'm excited about that. I've already showed you guys this, but I also got a, what is it? Hoyer lift? I believe that's what it's called. Hoy Man, I am just, I'm not playing around. Mm. We are going to have everything in order for my baby to live his best life here at home. I had it now I have been vegan for five years and I don't have it anymore amazing Claudia that will fit so much I know I just found you yesterday really Joyce oh my gosh well thank you for sticking around thank you for finding me yesterday and coming back today you know because you could have been like girl she's weird I'm gonna stay away that means a lot to me thank you looks like my son's toolbox Ew. okay so i made um, an anti-inflammatory blend to calm the body down blue vervain let's talk about this blue vervain calms down the nervous system i looked it up a little bit so let me just show you hold on did a little bit of okay here we go Blue, ver okay, wait, let me not do this one first. I, this one first. So this was the first herb that I put in the anti-inflammatory herbal blend, okay? I'm gonna move this down yet. Clean caregiver, thank you. Okay, so look. When you order a pound of pox flour from Mountain Rose Herbs, it comes in this. I've had, like, bro, look at how much hox flour used to be in here. This is incredible for anti-inflammatory needs. So let me read to you what hox flour does. Here we go. Did you know they alleviate hot, hot flashes? Write that down because a lot of people with hormonal issues, hot flashes, hot flower uh, helps in alleviating hot flashes, treating insomnia, and improving mood. Okay, so many of the perceived benefits of hops are attributed to essential oils and flavonoid compounds found in flowers. These are the flowers like xanthohumol and eight. Renilnarinjenin, I don't know how to say it, but it's scientific stuff that I just, girl, I don't know. These flavonoids may possess anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, and anti-cancer properties. This right here, can't you make beer, right? Beer out of pops too? Oh, this was a gift. This phone case was a gift from, um, como se dice? From Penny Wilson. And she got it on Amazon. Yeah. Okay, so hops flour, and then I also used um, ginger. Ginger increases serotonin and dopamine levels. This can reduce inflammation, which may cause depression. Ginger could also provide benefits for anxiety, depression, dementia, Alzheimer's disease, and post-traumatic stress disorder. Ginger, bro. Wow. As a fellow vet, I can't thank you enough for being the amazing person you are and having the huge heart that you do. You were meant to save our brother. Oh, 
my heart. Thank you so much. And I let everybody in that hospital know that he's a vet too. So that when they do their sly, sneaky, conniving things, not everybody, but they know you are doing, like, I have a whole family portrait in. Ah! Oh. See, the one bad thing about this is it hooks up to these. And like right now it did it, but the good thing is, is because it was hooked up, it didn't fall on the floor. So <laughs> that's a good thing. Um, let me show you the picture. I'm gonna go to my Instagram. My ex Instagram is exo.redroses. I just got a notification to be verified. Instagram wants to verify me. Oh, verify I'm, I'm not on Instagram like that. Mommy, you could get that you you could get that YouTube play button. If you get that verified, you can get really oh, no, it's Instagram. Mommy. It says, it, what? It's talking about a subscription. To comp Hold on, let me go back. Meta Verify provides tools that deepen your connection with your community. Hold on. Hold on. I'm, I'm going to exit out because I need to look more into that. I, I'm just like, what? That's crazy. Whoa. You have to pay for it, unfortunately, every month. Okay, that's what it showed. Why? Yes. Wait, what? A blue check mark. Why would you have to pay to be very... I don't understand that. I mean, I don't mind if I'm legit, you know. But, like, what? I'm so... What? That's interesting. Okay, let me look for the picture on my IG. My Instagram is exo.redroses. I'm just not like bro, especially people in the comments sometimes are crazy. So I just avoid the comments. I just go so that people can stay up, but I'm just like, ugh. Anyways. You be like that. Yeah, <clears throat> I would be like that with a whole blue check mark. Dre, you are an incredible person and an inspiration. Because of you, I have changed my whole life and turned more to natural things like Moringa, etc. Please don't stop. God bless you. We love you. I love you. I'm so proud of you. That's the one you pay for each month to have? That's so weird. Yes, everyone can get it, but you got to pay. Oh, well, then that ain't... Nah. That's so weird. No, thank you. I don't, I don't need no damn, I don't need no damn blue check mark. You keep, keep your money. Okay. <laughs> it's new. Just like Twitter is doing now. Facebook and Insta. I had no idea. The herbal secrets. They won't tell you. Oh, that's good. Angelica. That's a good one. Okay. This right here. This. It's kind of blurry looking. This photo right here, before I got off of um, social media, I had a gift. Someone had um, made this photo into a big, huge portrait, like at Walgreens, you know how, or like a canvas. I think it's similar to Walgreens. I don't know, but it's a canvas and it's huge that's in the room you know what i should do i should print out pictures of vaughn in his military uniform that's what i will do because maybe if there were more pictures around people can see that you're not just doing this to a family man this is a veteran too absolutely not okay uh-uh <sighs> i can't look at the comments on your instagram <laughs> or FB because people be giving me high blood pressure. Gar. <laughs> Thank you, Taylor. Yes, now you can pay to get that mark. That's how Instagram is making their money. That's crazy. 
Did you have braces? I did. I had them twice, actually. My teeth were just like all over the place. Anyways, I have this printed and thank you to the mamacita who told me she was a former vet because that kind of gave me the idea of I need to print out pictures of Vaughn in his uniform so that they can see. Okay, let's go back to the ginger. Um, it is also, it can treat a wide range of diseases via immunonutrition and anti-inflammatory responses. As a result of anti-inflammatory effect of ginger, it can reduce muscle pain after intense physical activity. Okay? Okay. So this is what I use in the anti-inflammatory. I use hops, flour, ginger root, and a lot. It's gonna burn your throat, but it's a good feeling. I like the burn of the throat. Oh my gosh, let's talk about hops again, because I printed this out, or I screenshot this for hops. Com and this is more of like the scientific, okay? Commenting on the potential mechanisms of action, the scientists noted that hops extracts have been shown to have anti-inflammatory potential by inhibiting cyclogenase 2, an enzyme that is well known to be responsible for inflammation and pain. So it inhibits that. This is what hops flower does. Hops is a plant. The dried flowering part of the plant is used to make medicine. That is what this, that's what the hops flower. Hops is used for anxiety, inability to sleep, insomnia, and other sleep disorders, restlessness, tension, excitability, attention deficit, hyperactivity disorder, or ADHD, nervousness, and irritability. That's amazing. That's hops flower. Now let's talk about blue vervain. Studies show us that, act, I don't know how to say it, anxiolytic and sedative effects of vervain. This is especially true with blue vervain as it can calm the nervous system. I like the burn in, I like a lot of things in my throat, I'm just saying, okay, shoot. Um, another Japanese study showed how one could use vervain as a nerve tonic. Ingestion of vervain was found to improve sleep time and quality. Wow. Do you have a video of how to soak seeds? I've done it on, on, on life before. It's just so easy. You just put a little bit of liquid in a bowl or in a little cup. Okay. Vervain extract may benefit certain neurological or brain related conditions. Studies in rats show that the vervain's glycoside verbenalin, also known as cornin, may significantly improve brain damage after a stroke. Blue vervain can even help seizures. It calms the body, calms the brain. This can, bro, amazing. Okay, another herb that I used was ashwagandha. Let's talk about this real quick. Ashwagandha contains chemicals that might help calm the brain, reduce swelling, lower blood pressure, because there's a lot of people that always ask me about blood pressure. Moringa lowers blood pressure. Moringa seeds, I, I mean, just, I swear, if you don't do anything else, like Moringa seeds are just so potent and nutrient dense. You, t you don't even need a lot of seeds and your body is just like, boom, hit with all kinds of goodness, okay? And, and it contains chemicals that might help alter the immune system. Okay, since ashwagandha is traditionally used as an adaptogen, it is used for many conditions related to stress. Okay, Ap adaptogens are believed to help the body resist physical and mental stress. Okay, researchers continue to study ashwagandha's efficacy in improving strength and muscle size. There's a lot of bodybuilders who use ashwagandha. Once, especially vegan, bodybuilders herbs to get them gains ashwagandha 
One study found, and, and take that down because there's a lot of people are like, Dre, I'm so thin. I'm so skinny. I need help. I don't want to lose weight. Now you know. Another study observed an increase in muscle power alongside a lower body fat percentage and reduced cholesterol levels when ashwagandha was consumed. Additionally, ashwagandha may increase muscle strength. I already said that, okay? In one study, male participants who took 600 milligrams of ashwagandha per day and participated in resistance training for eight weeks had significantly significantly greater gains in muscle strength and size compared to a placebo group. The ashwagandha makes you feel so relaxed but not tired or lazy. I've been taking the moringa seeds for months since you told me about them. They help a lot with my fibromyalgia. Brandy, that's amazing. That's amazing. I would double check if Insta sent you a message that you are verified. Just checked and Insta says it will not message you that you are verified. Right. It could possibly be a scam. Thank you so much. Meta is revising everything right now. I had no idea. Yeah, it was on the Instagram app, um, but it was telling me to sign up and pay. And I'm just like, uh. no, you're going to verify me because I need to be verified and I'm legit. I don't need to pay. No, no. I will stay unverified. You know, like. <sighs> What do you think about taking, I take special tea with a K every day. So what I've been taking and the, the only place that I am comfortable enough promoting, cause I've had special tea with the K several places. There's some shops in Yuma. There's some shops here in Tucson. Nothing compares to herbal mine. I'm telling you, it is amazing. This special tea with the K, I absolutely stand by without a doubt. Um, oh, the lip color, I will tell you a little bit later. It's the same thing that I wear every day. It's the same liquor color from yesterday and the day before and the day before. Um, I Oh, cold brew. It's called cold brew. It's the NYX lip liner cold brew. And this is undressed or turn on. I don't remember, but they're both NYX products. I'm telling you guys, this lip color, this combo is just by God. So... Cold brew, write that down also. Cold brew, because once I get off the live, you're gonna, you're, you might not remember unless you write it down. Cold brew, NYX, and NYX lingerie double XL turn on and undressed. I don't know which one I have on today, but both of them are very similar in color and oh, so beautiful. In fact, if I do not use the lip liner, this is a much lighter color. This color is way lighter, but because I have the lip liner, it is darker. Yeah. Oh yeah, I haven't tried it yet. Thank you, baby. All right, so that that's the that's what I made for the anti-inflammatory herbal blend: ginger root, ashwagandha, blue vervain, hops flower. Oh, and I use dandelion root. The reason why I use dandelion root is to assist with the kidneys and helping the body to absorb the nutrients and the stuff first. So, and Fun says, now we gotta do something else. Hold on. So, Veya. Um, Bella needs help balancing out her hormones. Um, so we, she's not consistent on Moringa and Moringa helps regulate periods. I mean, in an, in an incredible way. So what is, I taught you guys this yesterday. So let me see if you got it in your notes. To balance out hormones, what herbs should I use? What herbs do you recommend after what I've said? I mix, oh my gosh, you changed your profile picture, Jacqueline. Um, I use normally five, but there's not a rule. Only use this amount. There's people that use more than that. Yeah. I think you should start soaking. Yeah, for sure. 
I, I definitely do think so. Okay, I'm gonna get the herbs. This is what it looks like. This is the back of it. So see if you could guess the herb. Ooh, Megan Faye. She got it. She got it. She got it. She said raspberry leaf. Sandra, raspberry. Amen. Yes. Tequila. Si. Sí. Pero mi hija son diez, no, quince años. 15 años. Mi niña son 15 años. Am I saying that right? Red raspberry leaves. There you go. Thank you so much, Shannon. Of course. That's so petty, Jacqueline. I have never heard of that, Tamara. Okay. Okay, so we got raspberry leaf. This is seriously... Dan uh, raspberry leaf is like a everyday herb. That is an everyday herb for everything. Yeah. I can't. That's okay, Tony. You don't have to chew it. Chop it up with a knife. You got this. I promise you. Need to see how you take it. Take what? Oh, okay. Not for her, but for me. <laughs> Girl, listen, let me pull up too. For me too. That's so funny. Okay, I see. Oh, you know what? We're also going to use sarsaparilla. Because listen, us women, we be bleeding, okay? Every month. Or we should be bleeding every month. Sarsaparilla has what? The highest what? I ain't gonna say it. I've already done too many lives for y'all not to know this stuff. Question and answer. Uh, Artura, my children have benefited exponentially with Moringa seeds. Moringa has, what it has done to my brain, psh, forget about it. Moringa is so long. Red clover blossoms. Iron. Yes, Amanda Garcia. Good job. Yes, Jack, Amy, Jessica. <laughs> Libby, Ariel, Amanda. Yes, Carabella. Hi, Jennifer. I love you, girl. Let me just look this up. Because a lot of these herbs, I don't have it like benefits of red clover blossom. Yep, it is used in traditional medicine to treat a wide range of health issues such as hot flashes. What was the other herb that we talked about today that helps with hot flashes? There's another quiz. It helps with osteo porosis, arthritis, and skin and hair disorders. I used this to grow out my hair. There were two herbs that I used off the top of my head to grow, no, three herbs off the top of my head that I used to grow, grow um, my hair. It was red clover blossoms. It was the berries. What are they berry? What berries? It was rosemary, red clover blossoms, and berries. What? Hawthorn berries. Hawthorn berries, yes. Yeah, puppy. Do you want your popsicle right here? Before I leave, and I will let you know, okay? Thank you. Oh my gosh, thank you, Amanda Stout. I appreciate that. We finally have my boy's adoption. Oh my gosh, Erica, congratulations. Like, if you can't afford, listen, the bag of Moringa seeds that are on, a, on my Amazon storefront. Oh, there's no pinned link. 
Hold on. Let me see. There is a link in the description that's going to have all of these. And save this link, you guys. Write it down in your notebook too. bit.ly forward slash slay links. This right here has my address because a lot of people are like, Dre, I want to send you something. Totally do not even. Uh -uh. In fact, I will just tell you, don't send me anything. Not because I don't want you, because I don't want you to feel obligated. Please don't. But this is for the people that really do. You can find my address on this pinned link. It's the very first thing that you will see. bit.ly forward slash lay links. It has all of my affiliations. It gives you direct access to become a supporter, to go to my different social media accounts, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube. Like that is like, if you don't want to remember herbalmind.net coupon code exo.redroses or I set by nature coupon code exo.redroses or the Etsy shop, my herbs for you coupon code red roses. That's a lot to remember. It's a lot to re like, and, and not that you need to, but I give a lot of information and a lot of people want to know where I get things. That right there. So uh, there was a reason. Okay, hold on. I need to see if this red clover is used for, for cancer prevention, indigestion, high cholesterol, whooping cough, asthma, bronchitis, and sexually transmitted diseases. As isoflavins have an... Et oestrogen like effect and can increase estradiol levels they could in theory cause hormonal imbalance okay yeah well this the hormones are out of balance and we gonna use this i want to get off birth control and see if that will help my pcos oh my god i'm proud of you for wanting to get off birth control i don't even want to go into that topic it makes me so disgusted. What doc? Uh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm, mm -mm. And there's an herb that also helps. I don't remember. I don't remember what herb it was that prevents. It's used as like a birth control. I don't remember. I don't remember. No me recuerdo. I'm not sure. Isamar, I mean, wouldn't iron be good for to raise the hemoglobin? Wouldn't iron help raise that? If I'm not mistaken, I the sarsaparilla. All I can think of right now off the top of my head is that, but also kale. Juicing kale, using kale smoothies. You need purple leafy greens. Um, so making kale smoothies, having a kale salad, kale it up. And don't get the green kale, get the purple kale. Get the red kale, purple kale. Yeah, it does? Okay, perfecto. See, there you go. And then I need... Okay, I don't think I have my berries, but let me look up the benefits. Benefits of pink rose petals. I believe the red pink or the red rose petals I believe that helps with menstruation as well I came off birth control about a year ago still hasn't returned to normal cycle I'm not surprised that's to be expected so Kaylee what this is going to balance out hormones I'm making this as a hormone balancer now, Damiana does help balance out hormones, but you got to be careful because it's also an aphrodisiac. And this Damiana is Viagra in a pluck your wicks. Uh, why? Damiana is like, I, listen, where's my children? Okay, let me take you to the room.
Thank you, Sharon. Yeah, that's why it's important to take notes, y'all. And also, rewatch the video. Rewatch the video, okay? I told y'all get a notebook and a pen before I started talking, y'all. Come on. Damiana Pro. I, my libido, and we're talking about before, okay? My libido was high, high, high. I didn't need no help in this department. I needed something to slow me down, okay? Especially because I feel like Vaughn's libido was normal, but mine was just, you know? Um, bro, when I took this, and it's not this one, the Damiana, let me tell you, from I Set by Nature, I have a coupon code with them. Their Damiana, it's from Jamaica, bro. I'm talking about, this is like a Viagra for men and women. Bro, talk about Niagara Falls. I'm telling you, like, normally I'm the, the, listen, I couldn't resist Vaughn and he couldn't get enough of me. I'm telling y'all, it is amazing. Okay, so I think that's about it. Let me put y'all down. Rose petals contain polyphenols, antioxidants that work to protect your body from cell damage. The polyphenols in rose tea have been shown to reduce the risk of heart disease, diabetes, obesity, and cognitive diseases. Wow, it can alleviate an upset stomach, diarrhea, a sore throat, or a cough. You can infuse white wine with rose petals for use for headaches and depression. Whoa, okay. Let me see if it helps with hormones. It reduces symptoms of menopause. Due to the healing properties present in rose petal pink, it may help to balance hormones in women that are experiencing menopause. This could include helping to alleviate mood swings, hot flashes and pain associated with menopause can you wait until i'm off live please i'm working right now thank you okay pink rose petals we're going to add some in here there were three herbs today that help with hot flashes i need someone to tell me those three herbs what three herbs? I'm trying to think of a giveaway I can do. I don't know. I don't know. But we're going to do a giveaway. What? Oh, wait. Do I remember the three herbs? Do I remember the three herbs? Three herbs today that we discussed help with hot flashes. Pop quiz. Pop quiz. Here we go, here we go. Let me check, because I believe, I know two of them. What was the other, okay, that, okay, hold on. I think I'm experiencing. Yeah, so Sheila, in this, I'm going to mix it up really good. Shake it up, shake it up. And then once I'm done, I'm gonna take a tablespoon one tablespoon, put it in a cup like this. And then I'm going to put about four ounces of hot water. Hot red. I need the three. I need the three to be in the same sentence. Libido equals Damiana. Amen. Hops, red raspberry, and Damiana. I think it's that. Hold on. Wait, was it? Hold on. Yep. Wait, no! I thought it was something else. I don't think it was red raspberry leaf with hot flashes. Was it? Wasn't it? I don't want to say. Hold on. Let me. Okay, who was it? She. Okay, it was Amanda O'Neill. Amanda O'Neill, I'm going to remember you. It was raspberry? Okay, because I'm looking and red clover blossoms help with hot flashes too. I thought that's what the one, I'm gonna have
have to replay this. Because I could have sworn I said red clover blossoms. Yeah, red raspberry leaf tea hasn't been linked to easing common perimenopausal symptoms. I was right. Okay. You guys have to tell me the three. I think I kind of already said it. Maca, really? I'm getting nervous here. Oh, so close. So close, Stephanie, but no. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Lindsay. wasn't Damiana. Let me see if Damiana helps with hot flashes. Yes! Jen Daisy. Yes. Hops, red clover, pink rose petals. Ah! You are 100% correct. What is your cash up? I want to send you something. I want to send you Jen, it G C N. Is that a C? It show sure is. Daisy. Yep. It was well, hops, red clover, and pink rose petals. Yes. Absolutely. Good job. What's your cash app? I'm going to send you a little money, honey. Okay. Do you have a cash app? Let me know. I have it open already. I have it open. I'm going to hook a sister up so you can get some herbs. I mean, you really don't have to get herbs. You can get whatever you want. Oh, and actually, can you respond under your comment so that I can easily find you? Here, I'll put it right here. What is your... And I'm going to make it two words. There we go. Okay, there we go. Because last time I wanted to send some money to someone and I responded and I lost it. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so make sure you respond to me. If you don't have Cash App, let me know what your PayPal is. And if you don't have PayPal, I will give you a hug. <laughs> okay, let me know. I got you, girl. I'm proud of you. I'm very proud of you. I heard Cash App isn't working. Really? Okay. Did, has anybody else heard this? I'm on it. I recently sent someone money. Like two weeks ago, I sent someone money. Mm hmm Yep. Okay, I'm, I'm going to have to go because I don't know when she's going to respond. <laughs> hey, um, so Jen Daisy, the one who got it right, I'm so proud of you. Congrats. Yes, the three herbs that help with hot flashes. Write this down, y'all. Hops, flower, pink, rose petals, and red clover blossoms, okay? A very good herb to help balance out hormones are all those three. And red raspberry leaf. Red raspberry leaf is number one in my book, okay? So the number one um, for, well, not, not for balancing out hormones, yes. Yeah. Worked for me just five minutes ago. Oh, awesome. Thank you, Amanda. Of course, you're so welcome. It's working. I just sent my brother money. Okay, perfect. Okay, let me put it away. Damiana leaf is gonna be used for what? Let's talk about Damiana. Damiana equals what? Michelle said it, and she's right. And Damiana is good for men too. That's how powerful it is. Damiana, hold up. Commented the cash app above. Why didn't I see it then? Okay, let me go back to your comment, maybe. Okay, hold on. I don't see it. Can you respond to your original comment? Or respond to that comment? 
Jen, I don't see it. Comment it here. You have to respond to my comments. And don't put, don't put your, um, <laughs> Tamara, exactly. <laughs> that is what Damiana is good for. Oh, Tamara's comment, it got hidden. She said intercourse, basically. I'm so glad, Jorge. I'm so glad. What are shakes I can make for a detox? Um, there's so many. That's that's really hard. That's really hard. I would make a shake not really for a detox, but to, I would use tea. Very good, libido, Jamie. I would use tea as a detox, not a shake. I would use a shake to nourish the body. That's what I'm drinking. Mommy, it's really good. Where is she? It's so good. It's so good. Where are you? What did you use in the smoothie, Mommy? Um, I put... Strawberries, um, I put raspberries, strawberries, and acai packet, and then I put, um, mm -hmm. yeah, and then I, uh, used some soursop, too, and then I just blended it, blended it. Soursop. What is soursop? <laughs> Damiana equals good loving. What is soursop good for you guys? Sat like, literally? <laughs> How do I say if any if if someone in my family was diagnosed with the C, the big C, soursop would be numero uno. Numero uno. Soursop leaves, soursop fruit, all the things. Dre, don't send it. Don't send what? Don't send her money. You know what? I need to pin her comment because I just cannot. Let me look for Jen. Okay. Okay, Tracy Ace make candles. Did you comment her? Kasha? Let me pin this comment. I still haven't seen Daisy or Jen respond to this comment. Here's her info. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know why I now see that. The first comment that I seen, here's her info, is Kami. And I'm looking and literally so many people have responded to it. I did not see that. Not once. Okay. Let me go. Esperate. Huh? Huh? Wow. And it has hair. <laughs> okay. Let me do this. Thank you so much, Sharon. Okay, here we go. Cash out. Oh no, not cash out. Okay. Pay. I think next time I'm gonna say, okay, you're gonna have to share this video. And then, wait, you have one P, A R R O. I got you, confirm, add note to get you some herbs, girl. <laughs> Okay, pay. <clears throat> okay, I sent you some money, honey. I got you $50. So if you do go and purchase any herbs, um, before you do, you can, well, if you order from Mountain Rose Herbs, if you gotta go to a herbal place where you live at, do what you do, okay? If you were like, dude, I don't need no herbs, but I need to put some gas in my truck, do what you do, whatever that money's yours. 
But if you were to get herbs, the link in the description, bit.ly forward slash slay links, click on that first and then go to Mountain Rose Herbs. Click on that and then place your order because I do not have a coupon code with Mountain Rose Herbs. What I have is a direct link for you to go and purchase herbs there. I make a small commission. It's like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to look it up. Cause it's, I mean, I am grateful for anything, you know, okay? Low thyroid, sea moss, girl! <laughs> Oh my gosh, Tiffany, if it's gritty, it's because you're not blending it long enough. You have to blend it. My sea moss takes like six minutes, literally, in order for it to blend. It will break down, but you got to blend the life out of it. Like, I'm so serious. You would think that it wouldn't be that hard. I mean, it's not hard, but it's going to take a lot of time. That was so generous of me. Aww. Of course, dude. Of course. Dude, it makes me so happy. You guys, I'm so proud of you guys for paying attention. Like, I didn't, like, this This is for Bella. She needs stuff with her hormones. So we're just going to, you know, we have this. And that also has sarsaparilla because it's close to period time, okay? When you're bleeding, you you're letting you're 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 bleeding okay i'm trying to increase the iron con or the iron in our bodies so this is going to not just be for her but for me too what about no thyroid cmos your body knows that you had a thyroid so continue to nourish that non-thyroid that's what i would recommend it's like and i don't know that's what I would do if I had no thyroid, is I would still consume herbs as if I did because your body knows it's gone. Your body, that's why a lot of times when people have, uh, you know, your amputated anything, like you still get pain in that area. It's weird, I don't know how that works, but your body knows how it was created. Your body is an intelligence, literally. So I would still, if I had no thyroid, I would still continue to consume sea moss because sea moss is gonna, sea moss and moringa seeds, if I didn't do anything else, those would be the two things that I did, sea moss, moringa seeds. And really all these health issues come about because of your body having too much mucus and too much inflammation. You don't need all these special names. All these diseases don't need any special whatever. It's literally, I, I just feel like people love to hear uh, like names of things, okay? So it, what if there were no names? What if fibromyalgia wasn't a word? What if rheumatoid arthritis wasn't a word? Do you know what the common thing that would be for everyone is? Inflammation in certain parts of the body. And some people have it in more parts than others, you know? So if we took care of reducing mucus, reducing inflammation, that's going to be the generic for, oh my gosh, a lot of these issues going on. Go ahead, Rebecca. Um, yes. Yes, go ahead. Please be careful and don't do the blade. I will, we, one of us will help you. I know, but still. Okay. It's called Phantom Pain. Yeah. CMOS is for inflammation, girl. Yes. Inflammation for wound healing, for regulating your thyroid, for stomach ulcers. CMOS is a superfood for your overall everything in your body. Removing heavy metals. It's good for children who are injured because of injections. That is removing heavy metals from the brain because that just heavy metals here, heavy metals in the body. It, heavy metals, Alzheimer, dementia, heavy metals in the brain, it removes it. 
CMOS is for everything. Like that's how I see it for me. It's a, for everything for me, okay? So just do your own research, you're gonna see. They say out of the 92 or 102 minerals that your body has, CMOS has 92. I don't know how to verify that or check that, but that's what it's called. CMOS is a just huge, huge, even Vaughn outside of the hospital, even he consumes CMOS because it's just that good. I was able to get the doctors to approve him having CMOS. Vaughn was supposed to be on a ventilator for the rest of his life. That's what was supposed to happen. Hell no. I don't accept that fate. That man needs healing. And there are things that help to heal the brain. I refuse to believe that the brain is the only organ in the body that doesn't heal. If I get a scratch, it heals. I broke my foot, it heals. If you were to take an x-ray or something of my foot right after I broke it, yeah, it's not going to look good. But give it some time, it'll get better. Vaughn's brain activity has since increased since the first week he had EEGs. So, uh-uh, miss me with that. People still today in the hospital try to convince me at the end of the end, this is, nah, nah, nah. I don't, I don't accept that. I rebuke all of that. And watch what I'm going to be able to help Vaughn with. Are you kidding me? Like, he'll be able to take foot baths? Like, you know? It's just, even now, I'm so thankful they let me rub oils on him. But like that man, he has so much potential, dude. So much potential. How do you know you're getting the right CMOS? You really don't. That's why I just stick to what I know. I don't want to go and look for all of these legitimate CMOS companies. There is two. CMOS said, put me in, coach. Put me in. <laughs> exactly. That's what CMOS is. Put me in, coach. I'm ready. Let's go. That's exactly what SEMA, it's amazing. Anxiety, lung issues, there you go. It helps with lung issues because it's called the expectorant. Is that how you say it? So what it does is it pulls mucus out of everywhere in your body, not just, not, not just certain places. <laughs> I don't know what shoes to wear because I wanna show my toes because I pay a lot of money for these toes. However, I don't really have big baby. Oh, I can wear these. Big baby. These are so from Sophia Rita Boutique also. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, let me see. Yep, I'm going to wear these. Okay. It might not. Okay, hold on. I gotta go i love you guys but do the shoes look okay because i'm wearing an all black outfit and then color you know i don't know moringa seeds i absolutely love and feel the benefits Eek. let me see your toes girl oh, that was loud sorry hold on let me just show you these ones right here okay look at this i've never had this type bro I love, oh look, and I'm wearing a um, M for McCray baby. Oh, 
okay, look at my little anklet. But the rhinestones need to show. M for McCray. <laughs> um, Moringa oil, Stephanie. But girl, you should have known that. You should have wrote it down. Shoes are fine. Wear a beige purse. I don't have a beige purse. Okay, I love you guys. I gotta go regulate and be an advocate for my man. And I am this close, this close to going live and telling everybody everything because I feel like my voice is not loud enough and I need people to speak up with me. I'm so serious. Like it's to that point where I'm gonna need to pull out all the stops to save his life, all the stops. It's so not okay. Okay. I follow a TikTok of a young man who suffered multiple brain stem strokes and the doctors told him he would always be a vegetable and to let him go. He is now proving them wrong. No way. That's amazing. And you know what? See, that's another thing. Like, I don't really like getting into it because screw other people. You know, just seriously. Vaughn's brain stem is intact. Bond's brainstem is intact. There's so many things that I feel like are worse that would have proved to me it's not good for him. But there was not enough to tell me that he cannot make it. You know, like, hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Uh-uh. See, and if that person who had brainstem strokes can make it oh my gosh thank you for that because i need that i need that and i'm gonna go print out pictures of vaughn in a military uniform and i'm gonna put it up on the wall so other people can see that when they leave him in horrible position this is who you're doing it to to a man who served your country okay y'all have a good day Rewatch this live with notebook, okay? It's a lot of info.